If you want a slice of gourmet cheese, you don't have to catch a flight to IC Europe or wait for a friend to bring you some as a special treat. This year, retailers are going the extra mile for the festive season, especially those in the gourmet food business. Shivani Desai reports. If you plan to gorge this festive season, there's good news. From exotic herbs to an assortment of cheese, Vienna sausages to wine from a dozen countries. You can choose from a variety of global gourmet food in your neighborhood grocery store. Retailers like Hyper City, Food Bazaar, Spencer's and Nature's Basket eager to grab a bite of the 1500 crore gourmet food market, which is growing at 30% annually, all want a piece of the festive pie. Uh, we see increasing level of expect expectation from the customer and the more uh, value-added products we offer, the uh, faster is the adoption and upgradation on part of the customer. Though retailers are going the whole hog to tickle consumers' taste buds, the challenges could be plenty as almost 70% of these products are sourced from abroad. Uh, there's a very large uh, proportion of our assortment which is completely imported, which obviously puts a pressure on us in terms of stocking, in terms of ensuring uh, that uh, the, the, shelf li the shelf life of the product uh, is, uh, is completely met, etc. In some cases, the import duties are exceptionally high, which makes, it, uh, which makes the products available on our shelves uh, far more expensive. Despite the challenges that retailers face, the margins on the gourmet food is 20 to 25 percent compared to the 12 percent for locally sourced food articles. But for consumers who are willing to fork out the cash, there's plenty on the platter to choose from. In Mumbai, Vashivani Desai, Ragini Varma, NETV Profit.